Hey there. Okay, sorry about that. Um, it's Thursday, the day we talk marriage, and I'm Leslie Dorries, your marriage coach and creator of the Hero Husband Project and founder of Foundations Coaching. And it's middle of December, I'm not quite sure how that happened. And so we're smack dab in the middle of a very short holiday season. And this time of year, because there's a lot of stresses, there's a lot of expectations, there's a lot of pressure about doing the right thing, making things perfect. And one of the things that falls by the wayside is our marriages. A lot of time at this time of year, people are starting to question whether or not they should stay married. Can they just make it through the holiday season, give their kids one last great um, holiday before they tear their marriage apart, before they break the family up? Um, and I'm hoping that that's not you. I'm hoping that um, you're doing okay this holiday season. I'm not a big fan of all the pressure of the holidays. I think that, I mean, most of us don't have Hallmark Christmases or holidays or Hallmark families, and it can be really hard when maybe you've suffered a loss, or maybe you're not exactly thrilled with your partner, or maybe you have some expectations of your partner that they haven't delivered on. And so we can really get down. Now, by the way, part of what happens is we're heading towards the longest day of the year. So we're actually, things are getting darker, both physically outside and also internally. And this darkness can have a snowball effect. And um, so we can, we can get to the point where we actually don't see the positives. We don't see the possibilities. We're stressed out. We're not sleeping. We're trying to make everything perfect. And let me tell you, as a recovering perfectionist, that's not possible, so let it go now. Um, what matters most to people is your presence. Are you actually here? Um, are you listening? Are you available? And this is a really hard thing to do, especially when we don't feel like we have a lot of time. And so this time of year, is a, you know, we do. We take into account you know, how the year has gone. Did we accomplish what we wanted to accomplish? Are we, are we thrilled with where our life is going? And a lot of times the answer to that question is no. But I'm going to challenge you. Is that a true statement? I know that it's really hard not to focus on the negative when things aren't going the way we want. But most of the time, if you kind of turned around and looked behind you, you'd see there's actually some real positives. So my challenge to you this holiday season is to spend some time thinking about all the things that have gone right. That doesn't mean that there aren't real challenges, but when we can put them in perspective, we can have hope. And that's really what all this holiday season is all about, is hope. So my hope for you is that you really consider this and you really start to think about all the positives in your life, in your relationship, in your marriage. And if there are some challenges, the best gift that you can give to your family is to address those challenges. So um, I know that was probably a little sermon-esque, but that's okay. And until next week, stay loving.